The epicenter of the epidemic, Wuhan, a city under lockdown, but still at work. Hundreds of machines working at two construction sites at a time to build new hospitals for COVID-19 patients. The new hospital is being built and designed at the same time. Many workers say it will be a new miracle. In just about two weeks, both hospitals were put into use. From today on, the Leishenshan Hospital will receive its first ever patient. Medical staff have worked around the clock to save lives, even on Lunar New Year's Eve. Part of the professionalism of doctors and nurses, along with giving patients hope. And many of these medical workers have given up precious family time with loved ones. Several rounds of reinforcements around the country have arrived. Military freight planes from People's Liberation Army have arrived here at Wuhan Tianhe International Airport. They are carrying some medical team and medical supplies to support the city. Meanwhile, medical centers outside the province sent teams to relieve workforce pressure at local hospitals. Protective gear is desperately needed. Donations from around the world are shipped to Wuhan. Despite Wuhan grounding all commercial flights for the time being, cargo paths are widely open. It's a one-stop operation. Soon after the cargo plane lands, medical supplies will clear customs here and got delivered to hospitals. Volunteers have participated in supply delivery, making contributions with grassroots efforts. Some have worked non-stop since the epidemic began. The sudden suspension of the city's mass transit brought inconvenience to a lot of people, but reducing the human-to-human -human spread of coronavirus was paramount. I was here a month ago. Back then, Hankou Railway Station was very crowded during the Spring Festival travel rush, but now the station is empty. It's just hard to imagine how many sacrifices Wuhan's local residents have made. The masks people wear don't hide their warm hearts as people keep helping others and staying strong. Zhao Yunfei, CGTN, Wuhan, Hubei Province.